Oh, that new and larger came in. I set it up in the dark room for you. Curious. Does the name Madame Shell mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. There's intel crisscrossing ARPANET that her body washed up along the Padillos River in Cyprus. Huh. That's so. And her head, two kilometers downstream. Reports estimate her death around August of last year. Of all places, you were on assignment in Cyprus this past summer. <clears throat> Coincidence, wouldn't you say? Our line of work is full of coincidences. MI6 was keen on finding her. A rogue double agent gone dark for several years. I suppose she must have exposed herself somehow to the CIA. Leave behind a trail of heads, bound to get attention. I worked with Madame Shell for three years, closely. I trusted her. But the moment I began to suspect something, she knew. I was able to fight her off, but <clears throat> she left me with this parting gift. Oof. That's a dirty gun. <clears throat> Quiet. So imagine my surprise when I read these reports. Madame Shell, body washed up on one bank, head on the other. Ironic, wouldn't you say? I'd call it poetic justice. The Tsar. Thank you. For what? <clears throat> well, I didn't expect to see you back here. It's not exactly something I'm proud of, Belle. The scar represents a moment of naivete in my life. I'm not keen on broadcasting it. I believe there are better ways to embellish one's character. But in our line of work, it's often more important to diminish the impression we leave on people. Being cheeky, are we, Belle? Are you taking the piss? <laughs> <laughs> 